Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to have a look at the obstacle course by drone programming. So what we are doing here is that we are looking at the drone footage that the drone actually sees and does all the computation. Now in the previous video we had a look at how the drone runs. So this was the video where it flies and it moves through the obstacle and it lands. So whether we had one obstacle or we had multiple obstacles, it is able to find those and it is able to maneuver between them and land appropriately. So how exactly does that work and what happens at the back end within the drone? How exactly is the algorithm implemented? As you can see, it turns around and all of that. So we are going to have a look at what the drone actually sees today. So this is the footage of that happening. So if we have a look here, first of all, it is identifying the center point of the uh, uh, obstacle course. So it is getting that center point. This is that center point. And then it is looking at where exactly is the drone relative to that position. And then it tries to align it according to that. So if we have a look at that, there you go. It's you can see this line is becoming smaller and smaller and after a certain amount this line will become steady so because we don't want to move it too much when it's close to the center otherwise it will keep moving back and forth right so if we have a look at this you can see the line becomes shorter and shorter and after a while it stops and as soon as it is done with the first one it tries it tries to realign with for the second one and as you can see it is quite fast it didn't actually oscillate a lot it just did it once and it was able to find it and there you go it happens for the third one as well so then the footage will stop and then it will land so the same thing we can see happens again it tries to align and when it goes through the obstacle it will try to find the next one, it will realign it, and then it will move towards that. Again, trying its best to remove, uh, to make the line as small as possible, the green line, so that uh, it is as close as possible to the center. So this is basically what the drone sees, and this is how it works. So all of this we are going to learn how to implement in our upcoming AI drone programming course, which will be launching on 2nd of April, and you should uh, try to get it if you are planning to get it try to get it on the first day because you will get it at a 50 percent off rather than 30 percent which will be for the rest of the days for the campaign so if you really want to get it first day is the day to get it and not only that we are also giving away five tele drones to the backers who back us on the very first day so make sure if you want to back back it uh, back us on the first day so that you can get 50% off and you can also get a chance to win the drone itself so that will be a very amazing thing that you get the drone and you get the course with it and then you can uh, run it together so uh, for the rest of the people it will be just the software so the the course itself will be video lectures and we will provide you with the code and it will be having three different versions uh, the first one will be basic the second one will be uh, advanced and the third one will be educator so the educator will have some curriculums and all the resources that are good for teaching in an environment you will have some exercises for the students you will have some written tasks and all that uh, for the students to have it along with the course itself so it's a lot of fun to play around with this and all of it is written in python which is the preferred choice nowadays so uh, it will be very easy to accommodate into any existing curriculums as well or if you are a learner uh, that is learning by themselves then it is very easy to follow along now we will also be providing the youtube course that is available uh, on youtube but we will be providing it without any ads so if you want to watch that you can follow through that as well within this course so it will be free with that 
So that's the idea of this course. Again, 2nd of April, that is the date to look after. And uh, you, what you can do right now is you can go to the Kickstarter page and you can click on notify me so that you can get notified as soon as uh, the project launches. So launches. So let me actually open the page up uh, so you can have a look at what exactly that looks like now if you do that again you will get a chance to win the trello drone and you will get 50 percent off so that is only for the first day that's why i am encouraging everyone who is interested in the course to cl uh, click on notify me so that you can get notified as soon as it launches and it will be easy for you to get it at a good price. So there you go, we have already 451 people who are interested in the course, uh, whether they buy it or not is a different story, but they are interested to look at what exactly do we have to offer. And our previous course was a bit expensive. So this time around, we have made it a lot cheaper. Uh, so cheap, in fact, that it is in double digits. The first version of this is in double digits. So you can think of what will be the pricing. So that's the basic idea. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like it, share it and comment. And if you loved it, then share it with your friends and everyone who might be interested. So this is it for today. And I will see you in the next one.